everybody wants to be a beast. Everybody wants to be number one. Everybody wants to be the best. Everybody wants to succeed. Everybody wants to have to be and do what they feel they've been called to do. The challenge becomes that most of us, when it's time to do what beasts do, we don't do it. So Ichi, what do you mean? Look, I told you, I wake up at three o'clock in the morning. I just woke up recently and it was 2.45. And the average person in me said, E.T., just pull the covers back over here. It's okay. You got 15 minutes. But the phenomenal in me said, E.T., if you go back to sleep for those 15 minutes, there's no guarantee you're going to get up at 3 o'clock. If you go back to sleep right now, you might wake up and it's 4 o'clock. You might wake up and it's 5 o'clock. You might wake up and it's 6 o'clock. All you have is right now. Are those 15 minutes that sweet? that you're gonna push back your dream, that you're gonna push back your goal. Everything you've ever wanted, son, you're right there. You're so close, you're closer than you've ever been before. Those 15 minutes are not worth the rest of your life. Those 15 minutes are not worth you slipping down the chart. That is not worth it because you wake up at 3.30, some other kid's getting up at three and he's got 30 minutes on you today. So I need you not only to want to be a beast, I need you to get in beast mode and stay in beast mode. I need you to put on beast mode. I need you to live in beast mode. Everybody's got a dream. Everybody's got a goal. Everybody wants something in life. But many of you in this room right now, your beast mode is idle. Your beast mode is not turned on. And when you leave this place, I'm telling you, your life is going to go to a whole nother level if you can learn to turn that switch on and keep that switch on. When you want to become a diamond, your whole attitude change, your whole mindset, your thinking, your relationships, the decisions that you make, how you spend your time, your energy, all of it changes. See, this is something that you can't be in this business. This business has to be in you. Continue to work, continue that course, believing in the worthy cause, the end state of it all, knowing that the pressures and the problems coming are welcoming. Those are the situations that are going to formulate and mold you into the person you want to be. Accept this as the reality. Sacrifice this day for the investment in the future of greatness. So I'm telling you in life, you start running from a class, you start running from a subject that you don't like, it will haunt you for the rest of your natural life. It ain't going nowhere. You gotta take that thing out, like, you gotta take the breath out. So some of y'all are afraid of math. Go after it. Go get it. Don't run from it no more. Go get it. You go in there and go get that grade. You go in there and get that information so you can pass that class. You gotta go get it. I want you to go in confidence that you've never had before. And every giant in your life, slay him. You go back and slay him. Don't kill him, slay him. I'm tired of people talking about, I want to be successful. I'm tired of people saying, I want to be great. Look, everybody wants to be a beast. And it's time to do what real beasts do. And let me tell you something, that means getting up early, going to bed late. That means you don't go to sleep when you're tired, you go when you're done. So remember, success is never on discount and greatness ain't never on sale. I challenge you to have more. I challenge you to do more. I challenge you to be more. You gotta get this beast mode. You gotta embody beast mode. Everything about you has to say, I ain't playing. If it's to have, I'm gonna get it. And I ain't leaving none of it behind. It's mine. Beast mode. I need you to recycle your pain. Because what you're going to discover as you're going towards your dream, and as you're going towards your goal, there are going to be so many people that come up against you. So many obstacles, so many trials, so many tribulations. When people ask me, E.T., like for real, for real, E., I know you can give me 20 things that you've done to help yourself to become successful. But E.T., I just need like one or two. Can you give me one or two? And one of the things I tell people is I outlasted the pain. I outlasted the pain. When I was sleeping in those abandoned buildings, I kept telling myself, one day you'll be a homeowner. Every time I walked into that abandoned building, I told myself that this might be your current circumstances, but this will not be how the story ends. All you have to do, E.T., is to survive today. Survive today. I knew that I would not be a high school dropout for the rest of my life. I knew I got to get through this one day. 
And so every single day when I wake up homeless, one day, every single day when I woke up in that abandoned building, one day, one day is going to be ET's day, but that day can't come if I give up today. So every single day when I woke up, I kept telling myself, today might not be the day, but soon it will be my day and I will recycle my pain. For a diamond to be produced, it has to go through extreme pressure, extreme heat. And if that wasn't enough, what makes a diamond a diamond is the cut. If you want to be a diamond, you must go through extreme pressure. If you can't take pressure, then you're not a diamond. After you go through all the pressure you thought you could not handle, and you think it's over, then they turn on the heat. Listen to me very closely if you've ever studied the diamond. Once it goes through that type of pressure and it finally becomes a diamond, at that point you can't break it no more. I've been broken so much. I've been defeated so much. I've been disappointed so much in my life. And I know what it feels like. I can do it. Once you get to that point, you cannot be broken anymore. You already in pain. Get a reward for it. Life happens. Can you give me 120 to despite everything that's going on? I never quit. I never stopped. I never gave up. We just kept doing what we're doing. In the midst of everything we're going through, I don't need you to talk negative. I don't need you to speak negativity. We are under dark times right now, but stay encouraged. Stay encouraged. Keep your head up. Stick your chest out. Continue to walk with pride and know that not only shall we overcome, many of us have already overcome. And if it was easy, everybody would do it. It's not going to be easy, but we have what it takes. It's in our DNA. Don't look at night at darkness. Look at night 